Hey, what's up guys? It's Chuck from Brady Adventures, and today we're going to show you our new ARV camp chair. I'll make sure to put links to the camp chair in the description below, and if you enjoy the video, please give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Thanks a lot. What's up guys? It's Chuck and Mackenzie from Brady Adventures, and today we're going to show you our brand new ARV Touring camp chair. Now the first thing I want to show you is there's a dog barking. In the past, we've taken cheap camp chairs that you would get at Walmart, and they're not that great. So I wanted to try something a little bit nicer, and I saw this ARB chair, so I got one of them. As you can see, it has a really substantial bag that comes with it. A lot of the camp chairs you get, it's really hard to get the chairs back in. That's not the case with this particular one. Really? Yep, really. The bag is nice and large, and it fits in there. I believe it when I see it. <laughs> This chair is a lot bigger than some of the cheaper chairs you might get. And it's also quite a bit heavier, but it's very nice. So let's take a look at this thing. What do you think, Mac? Wow. It's All right. so amazing. And you can see on the inside of the case that this comes in, it's sort of rubberized a little bit. So it is a little bit weatherproof. I don't think it's completely waterproof, but pretty nice bag. The first few times that I opened this chair up, I couldn't figure it out. It took forever. And it is a pain in the butt to open up. So let's see if I can do it successfully. What do you think? It's really robust. It's locked up tight. And to open it up, the first thing that you have to do is undo these latches right here. So we're gonna flip these open like that. And then you can see things start to loosen up. So what you wanna do normally is people are gonna Ugh, you're kind of trying to spread it apart and it doesn't really work and you're like, what the heck is going on? Here, so, let me help you too. The big thing that you want to realize is this particular piece right here slides out the armrest. And once you kind of know that, you can slide it down, but you still have to sort of spread it out at the same time and it never wants to cooperate. But the more I have it, the more it seems to do it. And then when you get it kind of where you want it then you're good to go have a Mine. seat Ken. what do you think Mine. let's show some of the features now that the chairs open up you got this little table where's the table go right here, right here. okay and you're gonna slide this on like that and fold it down and it is pretty nice to have that little table there does this like it actually stays on pretty good. The problem is, is when you pack it up, you have to take it off because it won't, it can't stay on there when you fold it up. On this side, we have two little pockets. So if you're camping, you know, you can put your keys in there, your wallet, or the chair's really pretty rugged. It's padded just a little bit through here and through here. It's got, I, I guess that's ripstop. It's kind of a little pattern on there, but it's really thick. Oxford weave, definitely very heavy duty. It feels like it's double layered. There's also a little mesh pocket on the back here. I don't really know exactly what you would do with this. You could stick something down in there. The cool thing about the armrests is they're really wide and they're really strong. So it's really comfortable to put your arms on here. Someone commented on Amazon about these maybe getting hot in the sun. I haven't really had that problem. Uh, the other thing about this chair is it can hold 330 pounds is what I think the website says. It's really, really heavy duty. So it can fit me and Mackenzie at the same time. I've only used this in and around the house. I haven't taken it out on a trip yet. We'll see how it actually works out in the end. This thing is definitely as hard to collapse as it is to expand. So first thing you gotta do is take off the table. Then you have to undo these latches back here. And now what you're trying to do is really get these pieces to slide forward on here. So what I like to do is put it on the corner and then try to start getting this moving. So now, um, now that it's sort of sliding, I can sort of push it towards that corner and then it's gonna just collapse just like that. And then, there is another little rivet down here where this latch goes on, and this latch goes on, and now you can put it into your bag. Just um, that, a heads up, you, yeah. if you like um, get one of these and 
you don't remember um, how to unfold it, check out this video. Right. It will help you. Absolutely. This bump. And since this bag is so large and nice, it easily goes right back in there. Just like that. There you have it. And it's got this convenient shoulder thing. You throw it over your shoulder. So besides the opening and closing, what do you think about the chair? Is it pretty comfy, pretty nice? Nice. You like it a lot, huh? Yeah. All right. It's comfy because my dad is my cushion. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching. And if you enjoy the video, please give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Thanks a lot. Have a great one. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel. And always feel free to leave us any comments or questions that you might have.